What if every setback in life was actually a stepping stone towards inner peace? Imagine facing the toughest days with a sense of calm and composure. Stoic philosophy, particularly Epictetus, holds the key. Epictetus taught that our happiness depends on controlling our minds. We can't control events, but we can control our reactions. This simple idea can transform our lives. When life throws challenges, it's easy to feel overwhelmed. But what if we saw these challenges as opportunities to grow? This mindset shift is the essence of Stoicism. Epictetus was born a slave in ancient Rome. Despite his harsh beginnings, he became one of the most influential Stoic philosophers. His teachings have survived for centuries, guiding countless individuals towards a life of tranquility and resilience. He taught that true freedom comes from within. By mastering our thoughts and reactions, we can achieve inner peace. His philosophy is centered on the idea that while we cannot control what happens to us, we can control how we respond. Epictetus believed that by focusing on our inner world, we can cultivate a sense of peace that external events cannot shake. His teachings offer a timeless guide to navigating life's challenges with grace and strength. In our modern world, stress and anxiety are common. Many of us struggle to find balance and peace. This is where the teachings of Epictetus become invaluable. His philosophy provides practical tools for achieving mental and spiritual wellness. Mental wellness is about maintaining a healthy mind. It involves managing stress, staying positive and handling challenges effectively. Spiritual wellness, on the other hand, is about finding meaning and purpose in life. It's about connecting with something greater than ourselves. Epictetus's teachings bridge these two aspects of wellness. By focusing on what we can control, our thoughts and reactions, we can nurture both mental and spiritual health. This integrated approach is crucial in today's fast-paced society. Employing Epictetus's wisdom helps us build resilience. It equips us to handle life's ups and downs without losing our inner peace. In a world that often feels out of control, this inner stability is a powerful asset. In Stoic philosophy, impressions refer to our initial perceptions and thoughts about events. These impressions are automatic and often emotional. However, Epictetus taught that while we cannot control these initial impressions, we can control our response to them. He likened impressions to the first draft of a story. They are not the final version but they influence how we interpret and react to events. By scrutinizing these impressions, we can choose our responses more wisely. Epictetus emphasized the importance of distinguishing between what is within our control and what is not. Impressions are fleeting and often deceptive. They can lead us astray if we accept them without question. By examining and questioning our impressions, we can avoid unnecessary distress. This practice requires mindfulness and self-awareness. It involves pausing before reacting, giving ourselves time to assess the situation accurately. By doing so, we can respond in ways that align with our values and promote inner peace. Once we understand impressions, the next step is to control our reactions to them. This is at the heart of Stoic practice. It involves a conscious effort to respond thoughtfully rather than react impulsively. Epictetus advised practicing detachment. 
This means observing our impressions without immediately acting on them. By creating a mental space between impression and reaction, we gain control over our responses. Detachment doesn't mean indifference. It's about maintaining a balanced perspective. It allows us to see things clearly and choose our actions wisely. This practice can transform how we handle stress, disappointment and conflict. Another technique is reframing. This involves looking at situations from different angles. By changing our perspective, we can turn negative impressions into opportunities for growth. This mindset shift not only reduces stress, but also enhances our resilience. Applying Stoic principles in daily life requires practice and patience. Here are some steps to get started. First, practice mindfulness. Pay attention to your thoughts and impressions. Notice how they affect your emotions and actions. This awareness is the first step towards controlling your reactions. Second, distinguish between what you can and cannot control. Focus your energy on what you can influence, your thoughts, actions and attitudes. Let go of the rest. This shift in focus can significantly reduce stress and anxiety. Third, practice detachment. When faced with a challenging impression, pause and take a few deep breaths. Observe your thoughts without reacting immediately. This pause gives you time to choose a thoughtful response. Fourth, reframe negative situations. Look for the silver lining or a lesson in every challenge. This positive outlook can transform your experience and help you grow stronger. Imagine you're at work and a colleague criticizes your project. Your initial impression might be anger or frustration. Instead of reacting impulsively, try applying Epictetus's principles. First, pause and breathe. Observe your emotions without judgment. Remind yourself that you control your reaction, not the colleague's words. This detachment helps you stay calm. Next, focus on what you can control. You can't change the colleague's opinion, but you can choose a constructive response. Perhaps ask for specific feedback to improve your work. This approach turns criticism into an opportunity for growth. Reframe the situation instead of seeing it as a personal attack. View it as a chance to learn and develop. And this positive person uh, by reduces stress and enhances your resilience. By practicing these steps, you can handle workplace stress with grace and composure, turning challenges into opportunities for improvement. Coping with personal loss is one of life's greatest challenges. Stoic principles can provide a framework for navigating this difficult time. Let's explore how, when faced with loss, our initial impression might be overwhelming grief. It's essential to allow yourself to feel these emotions. Stoicism doesn't mean suppressing feelings, but managing them wisely. After the initial wave of emotion, practice detachment. Observe your thoughts and feelings without being consumed by them. This mental space can help you process your grief more healthily. Focus on what you can control, your actions and thoughts. Engage in activities that bring you comfort and solace. Connect with loved ones or pursue hobbies that provide a sense of peace. Reframe the loss by finding meaning in it. Reflect on the positive memories and the impact the person had on your life. This perspective can transform your grief into a celebration of their life, helping you move forward with a sense of peace.
Epictetus' teachings offer a timeless guide for mastering our minds and achieving inner peace. By understanding and controlling our impressions, we can navigate life's challenges with grace and resilience. Mindfulness is the first step. By being aware of our thoughts and impressions, we can control our reactions. This awareness helps us distinguish between what we can and cannot control, reducing unnecessary stress. Practicing detachment allows us to observe our thoughts without being overwhelmed by them. This mental space gives us the clarity to choose thoughtful responses. Reframing negative situations helps us find growth opportunities in every challenge. Incorporating these principles into daily life can transform how we handle stress, disappointment and loss. It's a journey that requires practice and patience but promises profound rewards. Now that you have the tools, it's time to take action. Start by practicing mindfulness. Pay attention to your thoughts and impressions. Use the techniques of detachment and reframing to manage your reactions. Remember, change doesn't happen overnight. Be patient with yourself. Every small step you take brings you closer to mastering your mind and achieving inner peace. Share these principles with others. Help them embark on their journey towards a better life. Together we can create a community that thrives on resilience and tranquility. Epictetus's wisdom has guided countless individuals to a life of peace and fulfillment. By applying his teachings, you too can unlock the path to inner peace. Start today and transform your life, one step at a time. Start today. Practice these steps daily and watch your mental and spiritual well-being transform. If you found this video helpful, like, share and subscribe for more insights on living a balanced and fulfilling life.